Hello and welcome to the session. In this session we discuss the following question which says Solve for x log of 3 plus x to the base 3 plus log of 8 minus x to the base 3 minus log of 9x minus, minus 8 to the base 3 is equal to 2 minus log 9 to the base 3. Before moving on to the solution, let's discuss some laws of logarithms to be used in the solution. First we have log of x1 x2 to the base a is equal to log x1 to the base a plus log x2 to the base a. Then next law is log of x1 upon x2 to the base a is equal to log x1 to the base a minus log x2 to the base a. Then next law is log of x1 to the power n to the base a is equal to n into log x1 to the base a. And here we have that a is a positive number and this a is not equal to 1. Then x1 and x2 are also positive numbers. And this n is any real number that is n belongs to r. This is the key idea that we use for this question. Let's proceed with the solution now. We are given that log of 3 plus x to the base 3 plus log of 8 minus x to the base 3 minus log of 9x minus 8 to the base 3 is equal to 2 minus log 9 to the base 3. So, further, log of 3 plus x to the base 3 plus log of 8 minus x to the base 3 minus log of 9x minus 8 to the base 3 is equal to 2 minus log of now 9 can be written as 3 square to the base 3. Now using this law that is log of x1 x2 to the base a equal to log x1 to the base a plus log x2 to the base a for these two terms we get log of 3 plus x, this whole into 8 minus x and this to the base 3 minus log of 9x minus 8 to the base 3 is equal to 2 minus. Now for this term we would use this law that is log of x1 to the power n to the base a is equal to n into log x1 to the base a. So, here we would get 2 into log 3 to the base 3. Now again, for the left hand side, that is these two terms, we will use the law log of x1 upon x2 to the base a is equal to log x1 to the base a minus log x2 to the base a. So, this gives us log of 3 plus x, this whole into 8 minus x and this whole upon 9x minus 8 and this to the base 3 is equal to 2 minus 2. Now, since we know that log of a to the base a is equal to 1, so log of 3 to the base 3 would be 1. And so 2 into 1 is 2. So here we have 2 minus 2. This gives us log of 3 plus x the whole into 8 minus x and this whole upon 9x minus 8 and this to the base 3 is equal to 0. And we know that 0 is log 1. So log of 3 plus x whole into 8 minus x and this whole upon 9x minus 8 and this to the base 3 is equal to log 
1 to the base 3. So this means that 3 plus x into 8 minus x and this whole upon 9x minus 8 is equal to 1. Now further cross multiplying we get 3 plus x into 8 minus x is equal to 9x minus 8. Now multiplying these two terms we get 3 into 8 is 24 minus 3x plus 8x minus x square is equal to 9x minus 8 or you can say minus x square plus 5x plus 24 minus 9x plus 8 is equal to 0 or minus x square minus 4x plus 32 is equal to 0. We can also say x square plus 4x minus 32 is equal to 0. Now, splitting the middle term of this quadratic equation, we get x square minus 4x plus 8x minus 32 is equal to 0. So, here we have x into x minus 4 the whole plus 8 into x minus 4 the whole is equal to 0 or x minus 4 whole into x plus 8 is equal to 0. This means that either x is equal to 4 or x is equal to minus 8. Thus we get x equal to 4 or x equal to minus 8. Now let us check if these two solutions are correct or not. So first of all we consider x equal to 4. Here first of all we take the LHS which is this that is log of 3 plus x to the base 3 plus log of 8 minus x to the base 3 minus log of 9x minus 8 to the base 3 or putting x equal to 4 we get this is equal to log 7 to the base 3 plus log 4 to the base 3 minus log 28 to the base 3. Now on factorizing 28 we get 28 is equal to 2 to the power 2 into 7. So now log 28 is equal to log 2 square plus log 7 using the laws of logarithm stated in the key idea and further again using the law we get 2 into log 2 plus log 7 that is log 28. So this is equal to log 7 to the base 3 plus log 4 to the base 3 minus 2 log 2 to the base 3 minus log 7 to the base 3. And now this is equal to log 7 to the base 3 plus log 4 to the base 3 minus now this term can be written as log of 2 square minus log 4 to the base 3 minus log 7 to the base 3. Now these terms cancel and so we get this is equal to 0. That is the RHS is equal to 0. Now we consider the RHS which is 2 minus log 9 to the base 3. This can be written as 2 minus log 3 square to the base 3 that is 2 minus 2 log 3 to the base 3 further 2 minus 2 since we know that log of a to the base a is equal to 1 so 2 into 1 is 2 and 2 minus 2 is 0 that is we have the RHS is also equal to 0. Thus, LHS is equal to the RHS. And thus, we say that x equal to 4 is the solution 
of the equation. Now further, we consider the other solution which is x equal to minus 8. Consider the LHS. Now putting x equal to minus 8 in the LHS we get log minus 5 to the base 3 plus log 16 to the base 3 minus log of minus 80 to the base 3. Now since log of minus 5 is not defined and also log of minus 80 is also not defined Therefore, x equal to minus 8 is not the solution of the equation. Hence, the final answer is x equal to 4. This completes the session. Hope you have understood the solution of this question.